Hi, Ruby. Hi. Thanks very much. Sure. Uh, it feels like uh, you've saved me years and thousands of pounds of therapy. Well, I have. Uh, uh, my name's Johnny Mountain, and uh, if you recently saw the Great British Menu, I don't know if you managed to, uh, but I was on a programme. I was on a cooking programme. Now, are, are you a cook? I'm a chef, yeah, oh, right. I, I, or cook or whatever you want to call me. You can call me anything. Uh, I always feel like I'm going in the wrong direction anyway. Um, and I was recently involved in, in, a, in a very big production that was on TV and I didn't just listen to the voices, I physically did everything so I built my whole business around what was going to happen and I think this depression thing... What was going to happen, you mean what? In, in not a deluded manner, uh, I, this, this program was really quite important, it was like the top 24 chefs in the country and I was part of this competition. And uh, I, was, I was abandoned as a child, by the way, when I was three years old. And that, that's really strong in my life and, and very important. But this particular incident, um, it was all based around a television program. But I changed my business, I changed my life, I invested hundreds of thousands of pounds to make this delusion that I thought was going to happen, happen. And during this program, it didn't happen. The, what did you think was going to happen? I thought I was going to win the competition. Right. And and I would be the be okay. yeah, and the fucking judge. Yeah. <laughs> if you know Marcus Waring, is a fucking wanker. Uh, you can cut that. Marcus Waring gave me a two out of ten for my fish course. <laughs> You'll never get over that. Twats. <laughs> and uh, and during the production, I ri I didn't. I couldn't believe it. I ripped off the microphone and fucking walked out, really, and, and smashed the studio up. Um, because I wanted to kill him. You know, the voices came back yeah. immediately. This, this thing that I've suppressed all my life, it's got smaller and smaller, but it's still there. Yeah. You know? But as soon as well, he said two out of ten, I wanted to fucking kill him. But did really. you take it apart, the, the, the kitchen apart, the set apart then? Uh, immediately. Oh my yeah. god. And, uh, Were and I walked out. grab you? Yeah, well, no, they knew better not to do anything. They knew better. I calmed down though, um, and I went home, and I slept. <clears throat> and I slept. And I've got a beautiful wife, and I've got two beautiful kids, and for five days I couldn't move. Yeah. And, uh, well, God, thank you. It was horrific. What a guy. But. Thank you. <laughs> what a guy. Thank you for saying that. I'm all right now. Can we talk later? Yeah. Yes, yeah. okay, thank yeah. you.